This procedure works on most all GM products with manual windows. All right, today we have a Chevrolet C10 window crank removal. If you've ever tried to remove the clip uh, behind these handles to get these off of the uh, uh, window regulator shaft there, they can really be a bear. But they make this tool, uh, it's just a six or eight dollar tool. Uh, this one happily be made by Mac Tools. Um, the number is a DT160. I've had this for many, many years. Uh, but I believe even Harbor Freight probably handles them. But they're real cheap. But I'll just show you that how they work. Uh, you shove this in behind there and it removes the clip. So we'll just take it in here like this and take it and slide it and off that handle comes. And what that does is it pushes this little clip halfway. Uh, then you just go ahead and push it back in place like it was before we use the tool to remove it. And when you go to put it back on, you just simply put it on here and smack it and that uh, clip will set back in place and you are good to go. I'll give you a show there on that right on and it's right back on there so really simple to do uh, doesn't take very long at all okay I'm also removing the door panel off this truck truck and uh, we'll pull the uh, lock rod knob off here uh, there's one screw back in here remove that screw out of there then we have one two three and a fourth screw back here that we remove from the door panel and then there are two screws that go down here and here uh, that remove that armrest and then we should be able to pull this panel up push it in slightly and work it up out of there Okay, this door panel wanted to be difficult there is a clip here is behind here that I had to use this tool to get in behind to get it out the reason I taken this door panel off is there's something rattling in here and this is my rattle it has been uh, driving me nuts for some time and you can see it there. So looks like all I have to do is tighten it up right there. Okay, this is the bracket that was uh, loose and hanging inside the door panel and was rattling. Um, it wasn't a horrible nap, rattle, but it, at, at certain times you hit a bump in it and it would rattle. And what it is, it's a mirror reinforcement bracket. You can see somebody has installed aftermarket mirrors on this truck. And when they took the screws out, they uh, did not line up with this bracket or they missed the holes. Anyways, that bracket was just in there loose and well, I hope you out. enjoyed today's video and hopefully it'll help you out on how to get those handles off. Um, and if you would, please hit that like, share, and subscribe button. So that really helps us out when you hit the uh, like button and the subscribe button uh, with the YouTube algorithm there. So, and we'll catch you next time at Rusty Duck Garage. medium cut cleaner, McGuire's, and then uh, uh, we're following up with some swirl mark remover that kind of builds in the scratches and then we'll wax it after that.